Hello, I wanted to show you how I kind of remove some of these click sounds when I see that in a Camtasia recording. It's a little bit easier when you, um, I, I don't know. Um, I just wanted to kind of share what I've done in the past. So I just created a quick example. Um, so that we Testing one, two, it. three. You can hear the Testing click there. Testing one, two, three. And you can hear the click there and there's a click there. So when you look at it in this way, um, one of the things that I'll do is I'll expand it out, make this smaller. That's one way of doing it. The other way I do it is I come up here and I go to the timeline and I detach the timeline because all I'm really concerned about is that I'll move this portion of the screen either onto another screen or... Um, just put it in the background because all I want to do is I want to look at this part of the audio. So when I'm looking at this part of the audio, I can really make this much, much bigger so that I can s physically see the different, oh, that's maxed out. Okay. So I can see the little spots right there that need to be removed and what I can do is just kind of, because I know that that's where the click is. So if I go right there, yep. So once you get the hang of it and you're seeing them, then what you can do is just highlight it and then just take this part and drag it right down. And then this part, go like this, and just drag this all the way down. So I do it this way versus trying to mess with the audio effects of the noise removal because noise removal will get rid of any of that air sound that you can hear on the microphone that I was recording on. It, you could kind of you can kind of hear it a little bit and you can even see it when you zoom in. So I go in as much as possible and you can't see anything now. But if I come over here and turn this off, you can see that there's a little bit of an error right there. But if I turn it off, then the error is gone. So that's all that noise removal is doing is it's kind of taking the background sound and it's it's eliminating it. But you'll never be able to get rid of the clicks. Doing it, doing this trick though is a neat way of, especially if you have a good mic without any air, then it'll sound even much better. And I'll just kind of show you the example. Three. Testing one two three. Testing one two three. Testing one two three.